So I'm a special envoy to ITU, which is a part of the United Nations, uh, for women and girls in technology. I was part of an announcement about a new engineering college that's, uh, that's launching called NEU. There is actually lots of jobs available in engineering, but not enough uh, people that have studied it, and uh, especially women. When my kids were little, I noticed immediately that there seemed to be so, uh, so many male characters and so few female characters. And um, I didn't intend to make a whole life's mission out of it, but uh, I found that nobody seemed to be noticing that. We just go directly to the creators of kids' media and say, you know, these are the numbers, and they're astonished. They're really shocked. They, it, it, they had no idea, because I think there is a sort of cultural feeling like, well, we're past that. We fixed that, right? There's been... I mean, there's been strong female characters, you know? And, uh, but, but the world's of the movies and the, and the shows are, uh, are fairly bereft of female presence. I played the president on television a while back. Um, they did a little study afterwards that showed people who were familiar with the show were 68% more likely to vote for a female candidate for president than before. Just from one season of seeing me behind the desk and suddenly it becomes normal. I mean, if we were showing uh, women engineers regularly, I think we would have uh, much less problem getting, getting them interested in it. My institute is offering five scholarships uh, to female students that want to study at NEU, and uh, we're just very excited about that. I mean, the whole uh, idea that there'll be a new way to study engineering and that it will be specifically uh, designed with the idea of attracting female students in mind uh, is extremely exciting to us.